very excited to show you guys the bag that I've been using. I've been using it here and there. It depends on what outfit I'm wearing. I mean, today I wore it with this top. And it looks pretty, you know, decent. Um, normally I wear very neutral colors. Uh, I like to wear black a lot. Gray, white, beige. Just very neutral colors. And most of my bags are black just because I feel like it goes with everything that I have. And I just love black bags. I don't know what it is about black purses that... I just see a black bag and I just love it but I wanted to switch it up a little bit it is springtime and you know you gotta switch it up a little bit so I got this bag right here it's like an off-white bag and I love the size of it I mean it's it's a perfect size I love the handles of the bag I love how the bag has this strap this way I love the details of this bag I love how it's gold but it's not like a very yellow cheap gold that I don't like it's like a very clean light gold color and then it also has the details on the sides it also has this zipper pocket which i don't know what i have in here at the moment uh, i have some coupons in there from cvs but i'm going to show you guys what i have in here if you guys are interested in this bag it's a really cute bag that fits so many things it's a mess right now like a room i love the interior of the bag which is black and white and that just represents me a lot um but yeah it's such a really cute purse i also have a coupon code uh link for you guys so i'll put it down below don't forget to check them out and this bag is vegan which is very very interesting such a cute purse i get a lot of compliments on this bag they have two other colors like a rose blush and then a black one i was very tempted to go towards the black one but i decided to get this one and i want to say thank you to Melly bianco for sending over this bag for me to try i really really like their bags it's super cute i saw the bag on the website on the model and it looks a lot smaller on the model and it is bigger in person but i love it it's such a very good structured bag and it does not feel cheap it feels very luxurious and i love that about purses i have my favorite gum which is this extra gum and i always keep the containers i mentioned that in one of my last videos i love to keep the containers you can store a lot of things in these little plastic containers and you get like tons of gum so i always just buy this type of gum i have a gloss in here i'm currently wearing it right now let me add a little bit more this is by MUA academy which you can find at cbs this is the lip gloss in the shade bare one of my favorite lip glosses it's not very long wearing i don't mind retouching it up because it is a very pretty neutral shade I also have, oh you guys are probably going to laugh, I haven't been using my actual wallet in such a long time. I've been using this little pouch right here, it's such a cute little pouch. Um, I have business cards in here, I have my license and all of that good stuff in here and some coins. But I don't know why I've just been using this, it's just very convenient for me, it's easy for me to grab and I can just like find my stuff all in one place. I also have a menu because we just ate at La Casita and um i actually had some tacos and some platanos with frijoles and crema and it was delicious um here i have my makeup bag i want to get a new one i've had this one for so long it was a gift from a co-worker of mine when we used to work in georgetown and she gifted this to me and i'm still using it i just love this bag um this makeup bag just because i know that my makeup is in here like on the go type of stuff but i don't have a lot of things in here i'm going to show you guys what i have I have a brush and no powder. I don't know where the powder is. I have this Milani uh, liquid eyeliner, which I don't really like. The only reason why I have it in my bag is, you know, when your lash starts to like lift or something and you need to like touch it up. I know this liner if my liner starts to come off. Um, I also have this NARS lip pencil in here. So I do want to talk about this perfume right here. This is a little packaging that it came with. It is a coconut milk mango perfume. It smells so refreshing, so tropical, perfect for this time of the year. And this little cute packaging that it comes in, such a cute design. And this is the roller perfume. I've used this so many times. I just apply it like right here and then a little bit on my hands. But it smells so refreshing i used to hate coconut as a child but i guess i grew into it and i'm obsessed with anything coconut especially if it's coconut mango like that's the best combo for me or like pineapple but it literally smells like coconut mango it smells so delicious so refreshing so clean and crisp and it does not give me a headache i have a problem with perfumes giving me a headache 
but this one is perfect i'm gonna put a link to this perfume down below i think it's cute for like a gift uh, i know my mom loves coconut mango so i know she would like the scent of this it's such a cute perfume like just throw in your bag i don't like to carry it around by itself because it's easier for me to find it when it's in the little case so i didn't throw in the case i really like how it smells it just smells so clean and very refreshing i also have some key sunglasses in here these are the desi collab and my little uh plastic things that come right here came off so i need to see what i do and i can probably purchase them and just plug them in there because i feel like they literally fall off my face since they don't have a little i also have this mascara by covergirl this mascara is really 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 good it's the covergirl exhibitionist mascara it's just a silver tube but it's a brush i don't know i just love how it goes wider on the sides and it's very thin in the middle so it really grabs onto your lashes defines the inner and outer corner which are very very hard to get and you get like that full lash so i really like this mascara i have my airpods in here i don't use them that much but i do like to have them in there i also have my rommel stay matte powder which is the powder that i use with this brush that i had in my makeup bag so i've been all day outside just touch up a little bit with some powder and you just feel refreshed ta-da so I carry this. I don't really get oily, but like I said, when you're outside, especially around this time when it starts to get warmer, you do want to keep that shine away. So it's always good to carry a brush and some kind of powder. Also carrying my all-time favorite lip balm ever. This is the Hydra Essential Moisture Replenishing Lip Balm by Clarins. I'm almost out of it. I really like this lip. I have a receipt from when we went to eat today with my mom. And I'm also carrying this guy right here. Super lightweight, you can just throw it in your bag. If you go to like an event and you need some good lighting, this was sent to me by Pixie. You literally like put it on your phone and you can take your selfie. Like the lighting is really good, look. You can get some good lighting with this wherever you are. Just put it on your phone, take your selfie, and it's just everything. Um, let's see, I also have my all-nighter setting spray in here which is perfect for on the go like if you forget to set your face at home which this has happened to me lots of times i've gone out to like an event or something and i just forget to set my face with the full size i always throw this in my bag because you just never know when you're gonna need it and it does a huge difference in making your makeup last longer i used to never believe in setting sprays but these setting sprays are amazing the all-nighter setting spray by urban decay i have band-aids in here Oh, this right here is super interesting. So, I wore braces for two years, took them off, and then I wore them for about another two years. Um, and right now I have a permanent retainer on the bottom, like it's in the back, and I have it on the top as well. So, I always get food like stuck in my teeth, and I just hate the feeling of a dirty mouth. I, like right now, I ate and I haven't brushed my teeth, and I just feel so nasty. Like, I feel like when I talk to someone, it's gonna smell like pupusas. And I feel like I need to go brush my teeth. Um, but I carry these CVS interdental brushes. And they are perfect if you are always on the go. If you hate, you know, having a dirty mouth. I mean, we all should be very clean when it comes to our mouth. Uh, but these are the little brushes. Look how cute they are. So they're very tiny brushes. You could just like kind of clean your teeth with it. Get in between your teeth. Take out any junk and gunk that you have. And you're, you're ready to go. You just toss it and then grab another one when you need more. And I have this brow card which I need to put in my little wallet thing because I actually need to get my eyebrows threaded before I leave to Japan on Friday. So toss that in there. Um, I have another receipt. Same place that we went to go eat. What else do I have? Some dinero. And my candy. That's about it. Yeah, it's pretty simple. Let me know what you guys have in your purse. Like, what is something that you have to have with you at all times? I just realized that I don't have lotion in my purse. Like, who am I? I really need lotion in my purse because I get really dry. And today I needed lotion and I realized I have none. So, that is on my list of what I need to carry in my purse because I need to have lotion. What is something that you guys need to have in your purse? Let me know. And if you want more details on the bag, the link to it is down below. I'll put all the links 
everything you need to know is down below in the description and if you do have any questions just let me know and for now i'll be vlogging on my phone when i go to japan on friday because i don't have a camera at the moment and i can't film any makeup tutorials which is kind of sad because i really do like filming makeup tutorials i feel like i haven't filmed in so long that is it for this video you guys i hope you enjoyed it don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're new and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys